What's good, YouTube? It's Books. They lifted. I got another build video for y'all today, and it's gonna be the slashing four. I think this is probably one of the best slashing builds, especially for, for uh, power forwards. So you're gonna go with the all blue pie chart. We're gonna have Hall of Fame finishing, and we're gonna get badges in all areas. So that's what's gonna make this build a little bit different from all the all the slashers that's making the uh they builds with the pure blue pie chart but for your physicals you can go with the top pie chart to be as fast as you can but we gonna go with the bottom pie chart and it's pretty much the balanced pie chart so you're gonna have strength speed everything you're gonna be able to actually hang with the force so we're going to max out driving layup, driving dunk, standing dunk. So you're going to have 26 finishing badges, Hall of Fame. Max out all your shooting. You can't, you can't even take off one, but you do get 12 badges for shooting. That is definitely better, better than last year. And there's no quick draw in the game. So that's a plus. You're going to get six finishing six playmaking badges wait no nah, matter of fact put post moves at 55 and we're gonna get eight playmaking badges it kind of take a little bit too much more to hit nine not too much more but we don't really got those points to spare we already took everything off close shot so if you if you want to take your yeah, standing dunk down if you want to take your driving layup down or even your shooting and put in a playmaking or whatever you want to do you definitely can but max out interior max out defensive rebound you're going to put points on everything except perimeter and offensive rebound so you're going to max out interior lateral steel block and defensive rebound so you're going to have 26 12 8 and 8 and that's, that's definitely a good amount of badges for a power forward. And since you got badges in all areas, you, you're you going to be able to do everything on the court. Like, even shoot. And that's crazy. <laughs> for the, with a pure blue pie chart, power forwards, you you really going to be a decent shooter. Like, even with a 56-3 ball, like, well, it, it's going to go down a little bit more because we're going to max the wingspan. But... You're going to take your weight down until you get one, plus one on the speed, plus one on the acceleration at 213. And max your wingspan. And you get either a slashing takeover or a playmaking takeover. I really would go with the playmaking takeover because your slashing is already so high. I really would, would, would use this to... Uh, and, and you get... You get pro dribble packages so you definitely can go with the playmaking takeover I would so that's what we're gonna go for the video and you get a slash and four I'm gonna show y'all where to put the badges so 26 finishing that's crazy badges and it's, it's, going, it's going to be a good rep build. We already know the game. Same as last year. So, you can you can really put these badges on anything. Like, Hall of Fame contact for sure. Go consistent. Hall of Fame slithery. Live City, you could throw that on at least silver. You could throw your Acrobat on Hall of Fame. Fancy on silver. Relentless on bronze. Your giant slayer will work, and you got a lot of badges, so you definitely could put something on there. You could put put back balls on bronze, just just so you got the ability to uh, get put back dunks. And you could probably not gonna need drop step or back down punisher. Fast break finisher if you wanna get a little boost to your takeover. But I probably. I probably would go up on a giant slayer. Maybe 
Hall of Fame, Live City. If you're gonna be catching them all day, we'll go Silver Relentless, go go Live City, and that'd be pretty much perfect. Maybe maybe even you you might even want to go up on the uh, fancy, but that's where I would go for your shoe and badges. Go Dead Eye, go High Zone, go Range Extender, go Green Machine, and it's perfect. Hey, for your playmaking badges, you gonna wanna go go quick first step. Uh, you definitely you you don't, you don't got the um like the ankle breaker tight handles and space creator and everything, but you could definitely use the eight badges. You can go needle threader bailout. Um, throw on downhill because you 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 will you will be able to get those uh fast break opportunities but throwing your unpluckable that'd be pretty much perfect for eight badges that is and for your defensive badges you get eight gold clamps um you gonna you're gonna be you're gonna be down there with the power forward so you can go Silver rebound chaser, um, or even even bronze re rebound chaser, bronze intimidator, bronze run protector, bronze chase down, and you could throw on a uh, moving truck bronze. Or if if you don't use any of those, you could you could switch them and add them to the other areas. But that's where I would put the badges and. Yeah. That's just slashing four on books. They lifted. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.